Shoot it! Ooh! <laughs> What's good, y'all? Streezy here, back with possibly the final episode of the quarry. I've been looking forward to completing this game. And yeah, so far, two deaths Abby and Jacob. But I think I can save everybody else. It seems pretty easy. I'm just need to nail my quick time events, which I have been for the most part in this game. And I just need to make some solid decisions, which I think has been pretty good up to this point. But anything happened in this final chapter, I hope that you've been enjoying the whole series. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And let's see how this game ends. Oh man. This game started off really slow, but I'm happy that I stuck with it. Chapter 10, Bricks and Mortar. Playing as Max, he's back to normal because we killed Chris. So there shouldn't be that many werewolves oh left on each. There shouldn't be that many werewolves left. Laura! How the hell am I gonna get down? Ooh. Yeah, I, I think all the werewolves should be dead, except for Silas, wherever he's at. Oh yeah, oh, yeah he was at the treehouse. Emma took him. You gotta be kidding me. Because Emma went to snoop through the bags. But if I hadn't done that, she probably would have been dead. Okay. Gotta find Laura. <laughs> oh, man. What are you wearing? So now I'm climbing, I'm walking on the ground level. Let me make sure there's no card over here. You never know. But me personally, I'm not worried about the werewolves because Chris is dead. Um, his daughter Kaylee, which was a werewolf, was dead. We don't know about Caleb if he's a werewolf. And then Silas, and that's it. You know he love to hide these tarot cards in the most weird of places. There's something right here. Now look at this. Don't we should have just gone to the Harbinger Motel. So this is what would happen if I took the lower route with Emma. First needs to get off this island. Oh, someone's hat. Is that Laura's hat? She must have come back. It is. That man ain't got no shoes on. I 
I hear some howling. But how's he gonna get across? He ain't gonna swim over there, is he? Stay or swim to shore. Cause is well, I know as a viewer, Laura's off with um Ryan and the cop dude. You know what? If if Emma was able to swim over here, Max can swim to shore. I'm just saying, if Emma was able to swim over here, Max can. Because werewolves can't swim. Are you... S How was I supposed to know that? <sighs> I'm starting off with some. The table, help me. I I hate that. Bro. That actually made me mad. Max didn't deserve to die like that. How was I supposed okay. to know there's gonna be a werewolf over there waiting? Why didn't you just energy. jump back into the water? They can't swim. Great. Just like the cartoons. But what werewolf was that? It's been off all night. Gives us a little time. How do you figure? They don't like water, remember? Right. Right. Oh, we should have just been swimming in the lake all night. And die of hypothermia? No. All right. Well, we're good now. Night's not over yet. These fuckers know we're in here, and they're coming back first chance they get. Great news. Okay. All right. We gotta get a vantage point. Now this game wants to be unforgiving with your decisions. I'm so mad about that. How was I supposed to know there was a werewolf? I mean, I guess I did technically hear howls, but how was I supposed to know it was coming from over there? But I guess in hindsight. Max was the only werewolf on the island because I think Laura did say that. I should have just stayed. I thought it would have been safer just for everyone to be in one central location. So if they need to. Well, it's not like they need to leave. They just need to survive by the morning. So I'm pretty sure if Max would have just stayed, he would have been fine. Oh, well, no redos on this playthrough. What am I looking for? You know, there was a tarot card last time I went in here. Is that the case? Nope. Well, actually, aren't the tarot cards done if this is a, supposed to be the last chapter? So maybe I shouldn't even waste my time. That max death got me you 
hot. Cause it happens earlier. He would. It literally happened at the beginning. What am I looking for? Oh, find a vantage point. Okay, so go upstairs. Not those stairs. <sighs> that max death got me feeling some type of way. Can you not? Go up the stairs. Yeah, no one should be here. Everyone's at the Hackett Mansion. Or they were at the Hackett Mansion. Well, is that his family? I'm surprised that wasn't a clue to further examine. This is. Nice to put a name to a big name face. So what, you're like Mr. H's brother, I guess? Who? The big dude from earlier, when you and Ryan went to the radio hut. Mr. H's brother, I guess? Right, right. What's that? Jeez, I'm see really struggling if they're begging for a dollar. It's a camp letter. Chris Hackett's asking campers' parents for additional donations to help with a lodge renovation cost. Isn't that what camp fees are for? Where else would that money be going? Hmm. Well, whatever. I guess it doesn't matter now. Okay, before I go upstairs, let me make sure there's nothing left on this floor. this guy been here ancestral portraits yeah hack it yep large and overbearing this regal oil painting of septimus hackett holds pride of place on the lodge's chimney column a long time ago long enough ago that it was okay to have an oil painting made of yourself i kind of want an oil painting of me now Keep looking, of course. Maybe I should keep looking. So that's where I need to go when I'm ready. This is a classroom. Poor Ian. Some camp mascot to kick it before camp starts. Oh, oh Ian. Like the dog tag we found. A memorial to the deceased camp mascot Ian. From the looks of the drawing, Ian was a sheep. Though nobody got to meet him this year. That was a tag we saw in the cellar. The collar. Sounds about right. We have a camp mascot? Well, no, we did. Wait, you didn't hear? H hear what? He died before we got to camp. Uh, bummer. Uh, 
Yeah, that's it been the werewolf that killed him. Actually, I wonder if those two clues um connect now. The where is it at? So, oh yeah, it was Chris that killed Ian on the night Laura and Max were kidnapped. That's sad. So what's upstairs then? Whoa. Careful with that, that's a camp relic. <laughs> Relax, it's dead anyway. Ah, R.I.P. microphone. <laughs> a ring? Inscribe jewelry. Discard jewelry thrown off in a scuffle with the inscription reveals that it belongs to Bobby Hackett. Big the big guy? What is it? A ring with the crest on it. Oh, very fancy. You can never pull it off. something yeah uh, in Chris's surveillance room he's storing all the footage I think you might be right evidence trail cam footage hey we got something Now, there was another set of stairs I could go up. All the way over here. I'm going to see what's on this side and I'm going to prepare for battle. The High Priestess. Eliza was killed in the fire that broke out at her traveling show six years ago. 
Her ghost roams the woods of Hackett's quarry ever since, and she's been determined to get revenge on the Hackett family for what they did to her. Her tarot cards, once lost in the blaze, have allowed her to guide you through the night, though her motives may not have been as transparent as first thought. Hmm. Good thing I went up here. I'm guessing that was it. All right, time to nail some quick time events. the way that beats for life we're proud to say shout at strad and shout out loud we're hackateers two months and you never learn the words Are they here? Showtime, motherfuckers. Oh, okay, wait. Okay, Matt, just stay cool. Everything's gonna be okay. Just breathe. Oh, Emma's also in the same building as them. What? So which ha- Who is that? We end this now. No one else is dying. Run or wait. Can't you shoot? Shoot it. Oh my gosh. Yo, that was scary. You saw how fast it ran up on me? Oh, Caitlin, no. No, no, no. I, I can't help you. I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm not failing. Oh my gosh. He's on.
Hiding has worked for me this whole game. Hiding... We have... Hiding has worked for me this whole game. If this is the wrong move... I'm about to say, give me that whole breath command. Come on, come on, Dylan. We need to get to. Yes, go. Get to Emma. Get to Emma. Get to Emma. Go, go. Don't hesitate. You don't have time for that. Come on. No, 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 no. Emma has a silver shells. I can't mess up! No! Are you kidding me? I missed! Bro, I I hate this game. I I I hate this game. I f <sighs> This is so stupid. This is so stupid. Oh my gosh, how did I miss? Bro, this is the type of thing that make me want to, like, do that over. Like, that's some bullshit. Man, I kind of don't even care about the rest of the game at this point, man. There was a fire that wiped out dozens of people, and now there's werewolves and a ghost that roams the woods looking for her lost baby boy. Which I've just put together is Silas. Oh shit. It's a long story. No, it's not. There was a fire. Silas the wolf boy escaped, bit a bunch of your family. You failed to stop him. Burn. What happened in the past doesn't matter right now. Uh, it kind of does, actually. We need to know what we're up against, at least. What we're up against is a feral boy turned werewolf who for the last six years has avoided being found. No matter what we did. Every full moon we were out there looking. Every single one. Now the son of a bitch is finally here. So what we're up against is my only chance to end this thing for good. So how do you even know where he is? How the hell are we gonna find him just driving down the middle of the road? I don't even care anymore. Bro, that, that really pissed me off, honestly. Because I mit Take the we- Damn, can't, Why can't you do both? Reach 
Watch the gun. Forget that. Just get it out. Ryan. Where did he go? He can't have just disappeared. He's got to be nearby. Let's look around. Are you crazy? Wait. Don't don't tell me that. Where's Ryan? Oh, he's back there. Are we there yet? You're okay. Been better, but yeah. Over here. Got some blood. Leads through there. What the hell happened back here? Whoa. This is where we went off the road two months ago. You're trying to decide if you should shoot me in the head right now. Go ahead. If that's what you want, I won't stop you. What? What? I, I don't I don't get this dialogue. Normally, I'd have werewolf's blood cover our scent, but I'm all out, so we're high risk. We could be killed. You ready to end this? Let's just do it, bro. Let's fucking do this. Go team. Both deaths could have been easily preventable, especially Caitlin's. I should have just took my time. I, I felt rushed because the first one, the first time he ran up on me, so I just had to shoot. What would happen if I ran? Then went, it would have been screwed. God damn, this place has got some uncool vibes. The podcast didn't do it justice. You don't know the half of it. This is where I saw her. Her? I thought she was... I thought Max hit her, but then I was out here and she was something else. Who? The woman. The old woman. She was saying something over and over again. Oh my god, she was saying Silas. No, that's impossible who you're talking about. I saw her too. In the rum tunnels. It's Eliza Vorez. Silas's mother, I think. Who was she? She ran a traveling sideshow called Harem Scarum. Came here six years back. She kept her son in a cage. Called him Silas the Wolf Boy. Died in a fire. Some say she never left. The hag of Hackett's quarry. We've been looking for Silas ever since. How did the fire start? Really? You're still hiding stuff now? You blew half the head off my niece, Kaylee Hackett. One of the kindest gentlest souls to ever walk this earth. All she wanted to do was help that little boy. Locked in a cage by that freak show witch. What did she do? She just wanted to help him. 
Fravis. She convinced Caleb to start a fire. It was just a distraction. It's May Bales. Give him enough time to get silence out of his cage and give him his freedom. That's not what happened. No. Because within minutes, everybody was dead. You ever see Hayburn? Liza? Whole crew? Kaylee managed to get Silas to freedom. But Caleb got bit in the process. That's why you've been hunting him. Silas, I mean. Every full moon for six fucking years. Some hunter you are. So what would happen if I killed Caleb back then? Because that was Caleb as the werewolf. This, this is all that's left. Jesus Christ. Man. Any sign? Negative. I'm contemplating at the end of this. Should I just replay this whole chapter I or? This was here. We must be close. Oh my Did gosh. You see it too? Kinda wish I hadn't. Same. What is it? Silas the dog boy. That must be it. Careful. Well, we found we found him pretty easily. Silas is the f I'm so confused. Are you sure about this? Shoot. Can I look at the evidence? Okay, hold up. He's saying that he, she tried to help? I got something in my eyes. Hold up. Man, you know what? I don't even care no more. I've already messed up too many times in this game. I'm so upset with myself. Please, let's just let's just go before we we have to see him like that in human form. It's too late for that. I'm just saying. I did not I did not like how I played that chapter at all. I'm so upset with myself. I 
bet you think you have it all figured out. I bet you think you're fucking clever. I tried to help you. I tried to warn you. I even started to like you. I'm contemplating if I should even no, play this all over again. This. I will not forget what you made them do to my Silas. I've been with you all night. And I'm not about to stop now just because the night's come to an end. No. Whenever you hear a noise in the dark, a whisper from the shadows, the breath on the back of your neck, that's gonna be me. I'll be there. Now I will never leave you. But that chapter was so trash. But I mean, it's a short chapter. I could have easily redo it. I hate how that how I did that chapter. That was so trash and whack. Yeah, it's going through everybody. Oh my gosh. She didn't have to die. No one had to die. So that was Caleb. Bro. I should have just ran. So if I would have ran... All right, so that does it for the quarry. I I choked. I know I choked at the end. Killed three characters in one chapter. Unacceptable. Um, three? No, I think it was two. I killed Max and Caitlyn in the final chapter. Unacceptable performance. Yeah, I'm not really feeling good about that one. I mean, overall, I enjoyed the game. I'm just. Man, I, I choked so bad. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Like, both of their deaths were easily preventable. But, either or, I don't know. I'm sure there was a way to save everybody, and yeah. I guess I'll just have to look it up how to save everybody in the end. But, I, I feel like I did pretty alright up until that final chapter. But, it's like, yeah, I, I stumbled at the finish line. But, I hope you enjoyed the series, and... Yeah, I had a lot of fun, and I'll see you next time in the next video.